Hey there guys, Luke here with the Outdoor Gear Review. Hope you're all doing well. Today for this episode, we're going to be doing a review on the ESPIT 5-piece Trekker cook set. You guys have seen this before in our previous episodes, uh, namely the one that deals with the uh, ESPIT cube versus the trioxane boil test. You know, we've been putting this through its paces and we are ready to pass down the verdict to you guys. Might as well get comfortable and we'll get started. To start off guys, we're going to take a look here at the cook set itself and then we'll move into the stats. As you can see, you have a nice mesh bag and we'll go ahead and pull the cook set out of here. And as I mentioned before, there are five pieces or five components to this set. You of course have the pot, you have the cup, you have the alcohol burner, which is basically just a copycat of the Trangia alcohol stove. You have an ESPIT fuel cube plate. You have the stand, and that's it. So there you go, guys. There's the five components. You got the pot, the cup, the solid fuel base, the stand, the alcohol stove. Taking a look at the pot here, this is very hard iodized aluminum, very lightweight. And as you can see here, you do have the measurements, which are on the inside. Very, very helpful. You do have the handle. Same goes for the cup, handle, no markings on the inside of this. The pot has a 33.3 ounce capacity and the cup has 15.9 ounce capacity. Now we're going to be taking a look here at the alcohol stove. This has three main parts to it. You have the regulator and also a way to put out your flame like so and as you can see you can regulate the, the amount of heat. You do have the screw cap, which is sealed to protect from leakage, but honestly, I don't trust these very much. I always make sure to pour whatever remaining alcohol that I have left back into my bottle. And there, if, of course, is the actual stove itself. This is made from brass, which is nice, very lightweight. Now here we have the base plate for the solid fuel cubes. Basically, you could just put the cube on there and cook away. Here's the stand, which I'll show you how this works in just a moment. You can see the grooves on the inside here, and that's just so that it'll keep the stand or the alcohol burner in place. Very nice. All right, guys, you have seen the set, and now I'll go ahead and show you the multiple ways that it can be used. Now, when it comes to actually using this set, you will always use the stand. And of course your pot will sit on top just like this. Now, of course, you have multiple ways to use this. You can use the alcohol burner, which happens just to sit on the inside there. Of course, you would fill it up, you would light it, and then you would put your pot on top. Now with this being a dual fuel stove, you can use solid fuel and you can just insert the plate like so, light your cube and put the pot on top. Very, very nice, and also very, very efficient. And there you can see it, guys, the two ways to use this stove. You can use the solid fuel, or you can easily put in the alcohol stove. Now, of course, guys, when it comes to cooking times with either solid fuel or alcohol, you know, it's always a complicated matter because your conditions are always gonna be different. The variables are always gonna be different, so those times will change. Under the best conditions possible, you know, you'll have, of course, the best results. But you have to factor in temperature, environment, such as wind and so on, water temperature, elevation, and all those things play into a factor about how, how quickly you can heat something or bring water to a boil. With this little alcohol stove and the cook set, I can bring one cup of water to a boil in about six minutes. I can bring two cups of water to a boil in about 10 and I'm at 3,500 feet. ESPIT is the company that makes this set, but of course, just like most things, everything was made in China. Luckily, the quality is really, really good. There's no imperfections on this. Uh, you know, and also it's highly regarded on the internet. All the reviews are extremely positive and I happen to agree with them. I personally love this set. It's very lightweight. The entire kit comes together at 15 ounces. Now when I go out backpacking, generally I don't need 
a pot and a cup, so I'll either use one or the other. There you go. I always find ways to cut weight, and that's a good way to do it. Also, another factor that really shines bright with this set is the price. You can get this brand new on Amazon for $40. And I tell you what, that's quite a good deal because you're, you're getting not only, you know, the two-piece cooking set, you're getting the stand, the solid fuel burning plate, but you're also getting a denatured alcohol stove, all for 40 bucks. Pretty dang impressive. Also, I should say that the little stove will hold about four ounces of fluid, and that will burn for roughly 30 minutes. Now, when it comes to using, you know, solid fuel cubes, such as S-Fit or Trioxane and so on, I can generally get 16 ounces of water to boil with two tablets or two cubes. Not too bad. So there you have it, guys. A phenomenal cook set at a really good price. It's also extremely lightweight. Of course, you know, there are lighter systems out there, but then of course the price is going to go super, super high, especially if you begin looking at something you made out of titanium and so on. You, you really can start talking about hundreds of dollars. And you know, for me, it's not that much of a, you know, a give and take for weight. Uh, this aluminum here is light enough in my book, especially when I only take with me the components that I need instead of the entire kit. Not only is the kit very well made, it's very stable when you actually have it set up. You know, every, you know, if you have it on a level surface, you don't have to worry about anything falling over and so on. It's, it's well designed. It fits nicely in your pack. Very functional. You definitely have the two ways of, you know, using the stand. You have the, the solid fuel and you have the alcohol. Both work well. Of course, you have to be familiar with what, what works best in what conditions. But there you go. So, for 40 bucks, it's definitely a win. It's a very good purchase. You know, so if you're looking for a dual purpose stove, you guys, you know, you can't, you can do a whole lot worse, honestly. All right, guys, for this episode of the Outdoor Gear Review, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Of course, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good social stuff. You can check out our Facebook page, The Outdoor Gear Review, or you can check out our website, theoutdoorgearreview.com, where you will see, you know, this stove along with so much more with a lot more pictures and information. There you go. Thanks, guys. Take care.